I like pour over because it creates a nice clean cup of coffee, right? You get all those beautiful flavors in a subtle and very approachable way. So the first step of a good pour over is you're gonna pre-wet your filter just to kind of get everything a little bit warm and, uh, and, and get some of that paper taste out. The most important thing is remember, you gotta get rid of that water before you start to brew your coffee. Then you're gonna put in your freshly ground coffee and your grind should be a cone grind and it should resemble granulated sugar. So what we recommend for proportion for a pour over cone is two tablespoons for every six ounces of water. So when you start your pour for the pour over, you're gonna to wanna to make sure your water is nice and hot just off the boil. You're gonna pour in just a little bit of water to let the coffee bloom and that's gonna let the coffee hydrate and get it ready to extract. And then you pour, and that's the greatest part of pour over. You do these nice, even circles and you get to fill it up and it's very rhythmic. And you wait for the goodness. The pour over method just produces such a beautiful cup of coffee uh, that's not too heavy, but not too light. It's just, it's just so perfect.